Amazon.com. Mm -hmm. If you search for the, the Storytellers Anthology, you will find it. If you read the comments, I'm going to embarrass you now. Um, the, one of the comments there talks about some of, quotes some of the, uh, her, her sentences or part of them, mm -hmm. her descriptions in the anthology, and it's just fabulous. So you mentioned that <laughs> the anthology is available on Southwest, on Amazon.com. Mm -hmm. Amazon Where else can <coughs> someone who's interested in this work find this book? Well, one of the places you can find it is at Southwest Writers Meetings. Okay. Right. And we have meetings on the first Saturday morning of each month and the third Tuesday evening. <clears throat> if you go to southwestwriters.com, you will find out where it is that meetings cost ten dollars each unless you're a member and members a year's membership is seventy dollars for members this book is ten dollars at the meetings or at our office which is on carlisle mm -hmm. in bookstores and, and i know now they're available in bookworks and hastings up on um Wantabo and manal is that right? I yes. think so. Yes. Um, and they're sixteen ninety five there. Okay. That's great. Um, anything else you want to tell the audience about the work? We've got about the thirty seconds. Photographer, on. can you talk about the oh, cover? The, yes. Uh, yes. Yes. Yeah, let's the, talk about the, the cover. The cover of this book um, is a photograph, a professional photograph by Don Strell, who is married to Ann Hillerman who, of course, was Tony Hillerman's daughter. And he donated this for us to use as the cover. Yes. Yes, well, thank you, Peggy. Thank you, Jonathan. Thank you, the audience, for being here for this segment. Viking. Red state, blue state. We come from different places. Uptown. But Downtown. when we live united, we create real lasting change in the education, income, and health of our live country. United. Real change won't happen without you. <laughs> so give, advocate, volunteer, live united. Sign up at liveunited.org. You. And the Lobos have gotten their Mountain West Conference schedule up to a great start. You just say, come off the ball screen and read and play basketball. Just play like you've been playing your entire life. That's a mouthful. I know oh, it. That's pretty good, though. <laughs> I like that. The two teams exploded on offense. My name is Fernanda. I'm the wife of a teacher. Budget cuts affected my husband's salary, so I'm picking up some part-time work. We're doing everything we can to make sure our kids eat today. Tomorrow, I just don't know. Fernanda, how'd I do? Well, I usually fold the underwear first. I meant the acting, but good to know. Play a role in ending hunger. Visit feedingamerica.org slash hunger and find your local food bank. Spotlight on Tuesdays at 7 p.m. right here on UABQ. Don't miss it. this segment of Arts Talk with Jonathan Miller and Peggy Harrington. We've been talking about the Southwest Anthology, and it sounds like such a wonderful book that I've been having them tell you how you can get a copy, including it's available on Amazon.com, it's available at Bookworks, it's available at Hastings. At Hastings. Uh, and you can also get a copy by coming to a Southwest Writers meeting. 
So uh, there is another question in the audience, and let's have that person stand up and ask their question. Joyce. Yeah. Um, you were talking about the availability and the fact that all of us Southwest writers can get the book for $10. How did you decide on what the price should be on the book? How I did think you decide the that's price? That's something that many writers have no concept of how to set a price. Well, thank you, Joyce. Thank you, Joyce. Yes, I did that. Okay. And I played around with numbers. Right. Um, I looked up what other anthologies were going for, and they're substantially more than this. Um, and we wanted to beat their prices. Also, I wanted something that Southwest writers could sell for a flat fee, which is ten dollars, no right. tax, to make the transactions easier. Right. And they make about that much as well when you buy one of these books at a bookstore or from Amazon. And that's how we came up with the price. And again, all of these stories, all the editing, all of that was donated. And as they say in the car business, we pass the savings on to you. Okay. I think you'll great, love this story. It's an amazing value, and there's a, amazing content in it. Yes, that's, that's wonderful, Jonathan. And you bring out the point that Southwest Writers is a nonprofit organization, so all of the proceeds are benefiting a nonprofit organization. So thank you, Jonathan, and thank you, Peggy, for being here to talk about the Southwest Writers, Storytellers, Anthology. Thank you all.